From the age of exploration to the Industrial Revolution, from the beginnings of Silicon Valley with semiconductors to the latest advances in our exploration of the stars, venture capital has been a long-standing driving force for innovation and economic growth across the world, with investors backing the bold, the promising, the unstoppable to shape the future. This tradition found new life in 2017 in Singapore, when Insignia Ventures was founded, partnering early with entrepreneurs, leveraging technology and innovation to create fundamental enduring impact for the region and beyond. And over the past five years, to the crests and troughs of the tech markets and uncertain uncertainties of a rapidly changing world, Insignia Ventures has continued its mission of building great companies in its own unique way. But what is the Insignia Way? The Insignia Way means being built to last. Being built to last by working with founders from seed to growth, equipping them with the tools they need to have lasting influence in the region, be it as Southeast Asia's largest auto retail marketplace. We have to count our blessings because we have very strong supporters like yourself, Inglan. When I look back, it's super important to have the right investors that believe in your vision and your dream, right, in building the business because it's not something that you can build overnight. You need years. Or Indonesia's fastest growing digital investment platform. Who are only just at the tip of the iceberg in terms of acquiring users and convincing the new generation to invest. Indonesia is a massive country, 270 million people, and less than 1% of them are trading stock. So I think in terms of users and people we can further educate, we're only at the tip of the iceberg. Be it as the leading logistics first e-commerce enabler in Indonesia. I still remember building a team from the team of 5 to 30 to 100, 150, 200, now to 450 to 500. I think that's with 2,000 people on the ground too. So when we have five people, the problem that we're dealing with is different. The 30 people, 100 people, and I believe like that kind of learning curve have actually made me a better person or the company a better company on how to handle with these team members. Learning how to manage the team is actually the most important lesson for us. Or a social commerce platform changing the way goods reach rural Indonesia. What we do in short-term goal is always been calculative growth. We prefer on the healthy growth. It's not all about growing your GMP, all, all of your sales with all costs, but now with a wide cost, that's what we call. So in every single transaction that we make right now at Super, it needs to be profit. The Insignia Way means unlocking economic impact, supporting companies that are improving millions of lives and businesses in Southeast Asia and beyond, and creating more than 60 billion US dollars in tech market cap from enabling e-commerce entrepreneurs in Asia to scale. Like the core piece around providing them like opportunities to exit, for me, it really sort of encourages one level of innovation, where sort of new, better thought through products actually gets to the market which benefits consumers in general. What it does for the other side of tech, right, which is the, the consumers, is to hopefully provide them more choice. Without the platform in place, some of these brands will never get to some consumers. To shaping the way money moves in Indonesia. Because money transfer, as you know, Indonesia has basically be, become a culture in here. Everything is being done using money transfer. You wanted to pay a debt, you are using money transfer to do it. You wanted to send money to your family, you're also using bank transfer to do that. So we are in a really interesting area right now. This is something that's becoming the culture in Indonesia and we are doubling down on this product to ensure we have the best solution on the market. From leading Vietnam's retail investor revolution. Three years, probably we want to reach maybe seven or eight million and FinHai will be part of it. We have changed the way people think about how stock trading work, how to trade and change the perspective of stock trading. Changing the way Filipinos do banking. Deposits the in themselves don't actually make money for us. They're just the raw material for the main product that we make, which is both. We're trying to solve the huge credit gap, by far the lowest in Southeast Asia and one of the lowest anywhere in Asia on lending to consumers as percentage of GDP. It's a massive gap and we're very fortunate that we've proven we can get the raw material and now we need to put that out as money. The Insignia Way means inspiring innovation. From working with universities, hospitals, and research institutions to globally redefine mental health care, we have built to be clinically based and research backed as well, right? We have our own in house clinical team to develop the programs based on like well established modalities and therapy to kind of make it work. And then we drive ourselves active clinical studies with different research partners in the world, hospitals around the region as well, to make it sure that we are not just building a self care app, but one that's very, very strongly grounded in science. To building the infrastructure for crypto adoption in the region. Toward the blockchain side of things, I have foundation on that, and that is a very long term thing. It will move in that direction. But a lot of those products are being built based on the US dollar. So we need to figure out how to make sure that there is a thriving decentralized finance and ecosystem in the blockchain side in Asia Pacific, right? Be it in Sing dollars, in Rupiah, in Philippines, in Vietnam Dong, right? It has to be built out by the locals, and that will require us to be pioneers and actually working very closely with regulators to build out the ecosystem falls out. From leveling up conversational AI for Southeast Asia. We actually really focus and continue to push the boundary 
of the technology itself. At the beginning, when we actually come starting the Singapore market, once we're getting the mixed language, if we can actually build in the model with the very small data, building a complicated model, so actually that means that the other market, you're much flexible. Our ambition is actually, let's go globally and figure out more like, you know, applications and use cases. And also like we push the boundary of some technology development by the real business use cases. To educating governments on the future of open banking in Asia. Open finance in Southeast Asia is a work in progress from the regulator's perspective. So our approach is being as helpful as we can possibly be to the regulator. Someone needs to basically push that rock up the hill to kind of speed up adoption. So that's a big part of what Broncos does. The insignia way means leading opportunity creation beyond the 89,000 people employed across the globe by our portfolio companies. The work they do is directly impacting more than a million businesses and livelihoods from property agents. Success for us, given that vision and mission is on the intermediary side, bringing significant number of the 10 million property agents and property service providers combined also offline. We recognize very early on that the agent is an extremely important stakeholder in the property transaction journey. We see that agents that partner with home are more productive than other agents in the market. The fishermen. Ideally, what we build is actually like an operating system for fisheries in Indonesia that are starting from the cold storage. At least we got the inventory at the first time. After that, we build our hyper-local ecosystem there. Going forward, it's predicted that the, the number of the fishermen will be decreased because of the anyone who don't want to become fishermen anymore. With Fishlock, I want to make this industry more open. Everyone can be fishermen, everyone can be sales of fish commodities. So it is open for anyone, but we need to build a strong operating system run by everyone. And insurance agents. So to a health tech and issue tech startup, so technology is a backbone. Technology can create the cross-function connection in our business. All stakeholders can reach out for others easily, from doctor to patient and from insurance agents to customers. And we also want to offer a data back systematic tool for all stakeholders with technology. Doctors and insurance agents can use tools such as AI assistant to build the best approach for the customers, which will significantly boost their efficiency and performance. The Insignia Way means dedication to growth, with a growing team and community of diverse talents, leaders, and operators across Singapore, Jakarta, Ho Chi Minh, Manila, and many more cities in the region. We are constantly innovating the way we find and invest in great companies, from leveraging technology to redefining venture capital education. Although I came from a financial background in the banking industry, venture capital is something very, very, very different from banking. And right after banking, I jumped to entrepreneurship. And being in a startup and being a founder is something that I need to know about <laughs> to be successful in the business. Those kind of things that I felt I need to know to build a successful startup, to be able to fundraise in the right way and also select the right investors by understanding how the venture capital actually works. So that is actually the reason why I started IBA. Build to last. Unlocking economic impact, inspiring innovation, leading opportunity creation, and dedication to growth. This is the Insignia way in building great companies. And amidst today's turbulent times, we believe there are many more opportunities for unstoppable founders to emerge in Southeast Asia. I'd like to really thank Insignia. As Anderson has told the stories many times before, Yinglan and the team have been our supporter and believer since like day zero, I wouldn't say even day one. Not only am I grateful for a dedicated team, but I'm also grateful for Insignia as a dedicated investor. We've heard a lot of good things about Insignia, especially from our fellow startup founders. It feels like a family when we met. It seems like we're already in the same frequencies. When I met Insignia, they go to the park, they already do so much research about sleep. They already know how the products work and even they already use the product. Uh, until now, there are no other PC that doing quite the same thing. You invest in entrepreneurs before anyone else believes. In Southeast Asia, not many like that. And I think Insignia is one of the true ones who do that. And we certainly hope to be their partner of choice in building great companies the Insignia way. In the past five years are just the beginning for Southeast Asia and for us at Insignia Ventures.